technology of power by Now we move to the following section. In the overview section, we can see the construction of EMP weapon. Then next, the work of electromagnetic pulse weapon. Then the power of electromagnetic field in the EMP weapon. Next. Introduction. You can ask the word as e bomb. E bomb is nothing but an electromagnetic bomb. Then the electromagnetic bomb. You can think that the electromagnetic pulse is used, but you can think that the bomb is the one which has dispersed the most of the environment and affects the people. But the electromagnetic bomb, it is not in that manner. The electromagnetic bomb only destroys the electrical and electronic equipment circuits only. So we can't use the electrical and electronic equipment after the e bomb is affected by it. Then, to realize this uh, situation, you can think that the uh, city. In that city, the people are using the electric and electronic equipments in a best manner. When the e-commerce is generated to own that city, then the, all the electric and electronic equipments can be disrupted. Then think their situation. They are affected by mentally, physically, as well as they can be affected by economically too. So, the electromagnetic bomb destroys the economy of the city. Then, at the moment of the construction, the construction you can see that there is a green color. This is the steady jacket that prevents the armature as well as the state of writing. This is the armature and inside this, this blue is the explosive material. They, that may be TAT or uh, uranium or which is the explosive material. This state of writing is like a solid identity and here on empty spaces placed between the Armature as well as the state of writing, the magnetic green lines are present between the um, space. Next. The basic principle of EMP weapon is the flux compression technique. The flux compression technique we can say here the yellow color line is the zero resistance conductor and the blue color lines are the magnetic green lines. And you can see a red arrow which is the electric current which is going through the zero resistance conductor. Then you can see the principle here. The 10 magnetic uh, pass lines are going through the ring. If the surface area of the conductor is decreased, then some of the magnetic wave lines cannot pass through the ring. So, due to the change in surface area as well as the change in magnetic field, some of the electric current is induced over the conductor. That is the indicated by the red ring. When the current is induced in the conductor, uh, then the current is the which is produced a magnetic field so that it has the same magnetic as that other previous one, which is the Maxwell's equation plus pi equal to B, the magnetic field magnitude, and the surface area of the conductor is. The transmission will be different than the Now we are going to see about the generation of electromagnetic impulse. This is the main vital important thing to uh, detonate the uh, e bomb. How it will work means, here is a capacitor pack where high amount of voltage is stored and will be, this is a solid line as I spent before, it, uh, it is a state of writing and it has an armature and inside the armature, explosive materials are placed. In, to make this uh, E-bomb more wider, sometimes in spite of uh, explosive materials, they use nuclear materials. When the nuclear materials is uh, yet inside, then the bomb is called nuclear weapon. In this case, the, the switch is there. When we close the switch, the capacitor discharges high voltage as the magnetic just like a pulse. This high voltage is uh, flowed through the coil. This coil induces an electromagnetic field. But at the same time, there is a fusing mechanism is placed inside the bomb, which ignites the explosive material. The, when, it, uh, when the explosive material gets ignited, it just uh, broke. It just broke this bomb, and the electromagnetic field generator gets more heated. Thus, the capacitor is used to improve the intensity of the electromagnetic here. Here in the lower section, suppose if we want to make the bomb somewhere 
efficient. Here, one more stage, like same to line, uh, this uh, generator is loaded here. After this uh, detonation of this pump, this will be detonated. Like this, suppose if you want to make this pump more uh, efficient, we can kill us in two stages or inside the inside of uh, explosion material we can keep the nuclear material. In this uh, electromagnetic pulse, the current produced in it millions of amperes. So that my control it uh, rolls to the semiconductors that we are using. Also the capacitor band is used to generate an intense magnetic field. If you see the magnetic field, uh, we are using electromagnetic field for communication purpose also. But according to the frequency and the wavelength, it varies. For example, uh, when the frequency increases, the wavelength becomes shorter. Suppose if you are transmitting a uh, electromagnetic field with high intensity, then the uh, antenna receives the uh, electromagnetic field. Uh, suppose the, the received electromagnetic field gets a uh, high intensity, means the induced current will be very. Then the semiconductor gets roasted similarly. Here, here are the signals of events that they can. When the explosive material gets ignited, just say it blows out the uh, internal armature. So the armature and the state of ending is short circuited, which compresses the electromagnetic field that is induced inside the pump. Similarly, the total process phase and the electromagnetic gets compressed. Similarly, what happens when it is generated in the air means the electromagnetic photon is getting the free electrons that are available in oxygen and nitrogen. This free electrons induce an electromagnetic field. It reacts with the electromagnetic field and it reduces the intense electromagnetic field. Sir. Where is the EMPF explosion? It can be explosion from the near surface and at medium altitude and also high altitude. It varies according to the area. And the factors to be considered is the attitude of the weapon where it is generated must be considered. The distance from the weapon when generated must be also considered. Geographical test and it will be geographical feature also must be considered when generated this weapon. The effects are low level EMP weapons temporarily jam the electronic systems. High level EMP weapons fry the electric and electronic equipment. It also affects uh, communication, navigation, and radar sensor systems. EMP weapons effectively neutralize underground bunkers because all nuclear weapons can't do this one. It can also use as an alternate of nuclear weapons, which cause severe damage in the economy. Uh, conclusion just we have one of the following things construction of E bomb, basic principles of E bomb, and generation of electromagnetic pulse, and the varieties of electromagnetic pulse explosions and the effects. Thank you. This topic on display side. Last time we were EMO's paper, unfortunately, I have no idea that second thing. So, based on that, we will see. How it is possible to get millions of ambient from the device? So when we use the nuclear witness explosive, then the magnetic field is produced in the free space, when it bursts, and then some of the energy from the bursting material that the nuclear patient causes, some of the energy transformation to the magnetic burst. When it um, comes out of the bomb, then it uh, comes out as a gamma radiation. When the gamma radiation comes to the atmosphere, in the atmosphere it ejects the free electrons from the nitrogen as well as the oxygen. So due to this free electrons, more of the electrons will be ejected with the gamma rays. So these free electrons come down to the earth. Due to the earth's magnetic field, it will become compressed. So due to the compression, the sum of the uh, area will be affected by this. Nowadays we are experienced with the problem of short of electricity. Can we take it on the constructive study? Since the effect is very high, 
it is not possible because it is an electromagnetic pulse only produced. It is for only for uh, microseconds only it is producing. After that, the reaction is uh, done by gamma radiations and uh, photon surface only. So we can't use like a nuclear field for the production of the uh, electricity.